Hi guys, well today we're going to be starting our brand new topic of business and economics and um, hopefully we're going to discover some things that um, we can relate to our everyday life. Um, firstly you'll need to download that chapter, um, chapter one of the market system. Um, then, then as a class we're going to make notes using a video which is about scarcity and opportunity cost. It's going to be really introducing the, the economic problem that we have. So looking at the economic problem in more detail, um, you're going to be needing to download a PowerPoint and Word document worksheet. So that's what follows. Um, so you might as well download those at the beginning of the lesson. So we're going to go through the PowerPoint and as we go through it as a class, we're going to complete the, um, the worksheet. Then to finish off this introduction to economics um, as homework, and if you have time in the lesson, we might, you might have some time in the lesson to start finishing off four questions which make you um, think about the economic problem uh, that we each and every one of us face every day. Okay, now we've um, got around about three or four weeks on business and economics. Three weeks we're going to be going through content as such. Um, and then in the fourth week, um, or thereabouts, we're going to have two lessons um, where you're going to be doing um, an in-class activity. Um, okay, um, that's it folks for the minute. I'll give you a further update tomorrow. Ciao. Well, I'm really looking forward to catching up with you guys today because we've got an exciting lesson ahead, exciting times for us all. And in looking at um, marketing, we are going to finish off the first of the four P's product today. And um, that's going to take a little quiz to see if you can recognize some logos. The power of the logo, as it were, is going to be discovered. Then we're going to have a look at some TV commercials for Norada Tea. Yes, Norada Tea. Yes, we're going to see what the point of difference is and what evidence is there of any brand. Uh, you know, compare the ads, um, um, a, good brand, a good branding exercise or not is what we'll uh, discover. Okay, we're going to have a quick look at the websites for the two major businesses in the world. Um, well, supermarket businesses, or that supply supermarkets, um, that um, go unnoticed because they have a, um, a strategy um, whereby they don't... It's a product strategy, um, okay, an individual product strategy. So they don't, um, like Sony, have a strategy to promote themselves. These are Procter & Gamble and Unilever. Um, we mentioned those two in the last lesson. Well, we're going to have a look at their websites just to check out what um, we can find out there. There is a video, of, um, oh, there's a couple of things that you're going to have to do in your own time if you want to follow these up. There's a 51 minute video on the power of the brand. And in a sense, more important is Edrolo. Um, Edrolo, um, we haven't had the opportunity to really look into that thus far um, to any great extent, um, um, given the time that we have in lessons. Again, a point, I've got a link for you to have a look at, um, at marketing and, and the four Ps here. I really do encourage you to do this in your afternoon sessions in your own time. Um, this will consolidate your understanding of what we're doing. We will be looking later in the year to go through the Drollo resource um, after the trial exams when we go into the revision period. We'll have a, a good focus on Drollo there if you don't get the chance to have a look at it now. But I would encourage you to look at it now. If we get to finish all that today, then we will start looking at the second P, promotion. Now. Um, just looking ahead, we have next week we must have the a marketing assessment, uh, a section B test question. Um, I might look at also including 
um, a little snippet of a section C question as a separate task, as another task. But anyway, section B, let's focus on that. And um, in your schedule on sector, it has it down as a Monday, uh, sorry, Tuesday of next week, our first lesson next week. But I, I think we might need a little bit longer, so it might be towards the end of next week that we do that because I want um, you to have done or have looked at the section B question in class. Um, that we can all have a discussion about before you um, go off and do your little test. Okay, that's it for now. Bye. Looking forward to catching up.